Hey guys, how's it going? Back with another video. We at Forest Ridge in Davie, Florida. This is Broward County. This is another Tequesta marker I found right here in Broward. What some would call it Davie. I'm going to call this marker the Tequesta Trail. Well, I am walking at this, uh, actually a Tequesta Indian Trail right now. I'm almost there. But this is Forest Ridge in Davie, Florida. I made a video about this. This is where the second and third Seminole War took place. It's a sat it's a statue of a soldier right back there. I made a video about this like a few months ago. But I'm not going to record or go back there today. But yeah, there was a uh, second and third Seminole War historical site. The Tequesta live mostly in South Florida. When the Spanish arrived, they said this group of people were like, I believe they were more like hunters and gatherers, just like the people in Poverty Point, Louisiana. You can look that up as well. That's another ancient Indian mound and a burial ground as well. They got like the oldest Indian mounds in North America right now. They say, let's see, um, they say they are extinct. How's that? I found out most of the Tequesta Indians. Okay, we walking up the uh, the Tequesta Trail right now. I made it to the monument. I'm gonna be heading to the other burial mound, the Peace Indian Mound. That's in Western Florida. But I wanted to stop here and show you guys this little monument. They say the Tequesta is extinct. How's that? When most of them fled to the Caribbean, Cuba, Bahamas, that go to uh, Seminole soldier over there. Remember, you guys, I made a video about that, the Second and Third Seminole War. That was another um, territory where the Seminoles had occupied as well. But yeah, this is the monument right here. This proved that they was living in the area. But the Tequesta Indians did fled to the Caribbeans. So that means they're not extinct. And some of them had hide in, in the Floridas. Throughout the Florida coast. I'm sorry about that. Some of them went into hiding. And some, I believe, had joined forces with the Yamasi tribe, which we know them as the Seminole today. But y'all just wanted you guys to see this trail, this Indian trail. They turn it into a park, just like a private community. But yeah, let's get a little closer to this. I'm about to be heading to Western Florida right now. So you guys can see the other Peace Burial Mound. That's another Tequesta sediment as well. So this video not going to be that long. So I just, I just not got through walking the Indian Trail. Just now this will lead you right to the monument. And this will lead you straight to the area where the second and third Seminole War place took at. I'm sorry to place that, but y'all know what I'm saying, my bad. I just get a little excited when I record videos like this. But yeah, the um, Dolphin Stadium, the Dolphin Stadium was uh, to catch the settlement as well. And a lot of, uh, I say a lot of our ancestors was buried at the Dolphin Stadium. A lot of Seminoles, Yamasis as well. But yeah, hope you guys like the video.